Hello everybody and welcome back to SD Gundam Degeneration Overworld and the Fallen Fortress. This is a extra stage so when we complete it we'll be able to get a, a new commander which will be nice. So let's go. The Fallen Fortress. Let's do it. It's a battle coup sideways. Uh. Oh, Shar. <laughs> Bullshit. No, the zombies want control, not destruction. That's the one thing they have going for them. Heh, <laughs> armor there. There's a joke if you watch the if you watch battle log in uh of uh Try Battle Log, episode one, because Ribbon's Allmark's Japanese voice actor, it's the same as Amro's. So they kinda of make a joke about that when they, these two actually fight. So this is so this is after the one year war, but did Zion win or something? Or I'm merging in this random ultimate time right now. Question. What is that? What series are you from? You have a cubalace head and a big Zam laser cannon. The purple. You look really cool, can I have it? Oh la la. You're dating somebody who wants to do the same thing. Or you're in love with somebody. The amount of times I want to smack Shara in this scene is unbelievable. So villainy! You look so evil. I have like 10,000 things I want to check out. First, this thing. That's a Zarkello. It's an average everyday Zarkello. God, this thing looks so much cooler than a normal Zarkello, though. Oh, 
Okay, next is what is this? The Bal Barado. Nano skin. That was a thing that in turn A for the most part. I might be in other series, I don't know. A Bobo Neuro. Okay. Like other things that just have this this thing has its own Okay. Right. Oh. I want to know more about you. Oh. That was a degeneration machine. Okay. I can build it! It is buildable! It has a development plan, which means I can get it. I just need to find what it can up from and develop to. One day you will be mine. Until then, I'll destroy you. Uh, got a ship. Since we're in no rush, you guys kind of just sit on here. You guys just play around down here. We'll deal with everything we need to. Wow, that's harsh. Suzaku too, nobody cares. Anyway, uh so I so I gave uh so, uh, so after the Gelgu got upgraded, great, it no longer was his custom one, so I decided to give him the Gundam Axe. Because I had one, and I didn't know what else to do with it. For the most part, everything else is the same. Oh yeah, since the uh, Gundam Rouge got upgraded into the Akatsuki, I decided to give him a different red machine. This is the only red machine I had on hand, the Gabaldi Beta. So it'll be interesting. And so he has, and Garma has to go with Marine. I did a few testings with what Zionic was. Zionic is only, it's very weird. As you notice, it, it accepts the Super Zaku, but it doesn't accept Zaku Warrior, the FC Zaku, or anything outside the one-year war almost. As another test, I tried Haman's machine, which was developed by Axis. No upgrade either. I knew he couldn't. I didn't even feel to use it at all because he's not a new type. I was hoping it would still activate, but no, it's very weird. I also tried a Garadoga. Wouldn't accept it either. That's a really weird skill. I'm just gonna point that out right now. Now then, who? It's your debut, dude. Go nuts. Wants level. You desperately want to level, don't ya? I never know the Phoenix Gunner Pint upgrade is playing level 2. Nice. Little transformation mid attack. Oh, we have a new person on our ship, by the way. She's a temporary, uh, she's just temporary because her stats are actually pretty decently average. Money's all across the board, so I figured, eh, that'll be good enough for the ship, uh, for ship's, uh, executive officer for now. 
She'll eventually be put on, once we get a new uh, ship, she'll eventually be joining our main crew. Since, she's a, since she is a new type and she's actually decent. Anyway, uh, who should we send out next? Send out the Gabaldi Beta. Let's give this thing a test drive. Oh, by the way, I've also been playing uh, Gundam Sen 0081 Senki. Zion is hard! That's that boy. You know, Zion campaign is really hard. Or it was until I just finally, currently got the, uh, the free, uh, free knock, so that's fun. I haven't done the Earth Federation campaign yet, I'm like, only like, mich main mission 6, so I've been doing a bunch of the side missions. That's sort of normal, because I'm just like, how hard could it be? That is actually surprisingly more difficult than I gave it credit for at first. Eh, yeah, better go be rifle. Surprisingly fun. The problem with it though is since I'm an addiction to- I have, I have a tro- I actually have the different colored both- both the yellow funnels of uh, Kibla and the pink funnels of the uh, Phoenix. That's actually pretty good. Let's send the second group down below. Wind down a bit. Kill you. That's fine. Yeah, because the reason the trophy is going to be so hard, is the online trophy, is because it doesn't have an online community anymore. It's kind of old. Like, dead old. It's a shame. It's actually really fun. I know there's the Battle Operation 2, but I just can't get into that one. I've, I've, I've played Battle Battle Operation 1 before, and I liked it to a point. Mainly I do like the whole Zeon, Zeon suits versus or Federation suits. I adore that shit. right there but uh, this will be good for now but the squeeze sounds cool 
ゲスであろうこのアプロディアに歯向かう者は消去するまで See, I appreciate that line of thinking but that's not a hero's line of thinking Yes, I'm no hero. I like villains. I like certain villains. I have a feeling this music is gonna get me copyright shitted on. Oh well. It's not like I make any money from it anyway. As long as they don't copyright strike it, I don't really care if they claim it too much. Sure that I miss it quickly. But yeah, no, uh, yeah, if I ever want to make money off this, first I'd have to be a lot more popular with what I'm doing now, and so I don't think I, have to be, I would have to be doing this a lot longer and play something. I don't think I'm even Gundam because Gundam is not the most popular thing video wise. Or at least Gundam games. It's a slow gathering, but it's a, it's a good one. But if I actually wanted to make money, I'd have to do something else and go through, uh, what's it called, uh. Ooh, wait. I'm gonna drop the first line of thought and go to this one Gundam Killer is a skill I don't like. Basically, because you barely ever fight. Sorry, this series is good for it, because the Gundams betray you, so it's a good skill. G-Generation Genesis, it's a horrible skill to ever have. Because you're never fighting Gundams, you mostly play on the side of the heroes. All but two campaigns, I think, you ever fight one Gundam. So it's a horrible, horrible skill to have. That's a master skill anyway, so you can't even use it. You turn out a master type. We could actually make you a master of the second group, actually, yeah. Now, that's a thought. Okay. Anyway, back to my original thought of uh, monetization and uh, YouTube and stuff. I'd have to probably go through a, uh, what's it called, uh... Well, actually, just forget about that. I probably would, I would, as I said, that's if I want to. I don't want to. Not worth it. Like, if I suddenly get millions of followers, maybe. Probably won't, probably won't happen, as I said, but those aren't my thoughts. My thoughts are just playing some Gundam games and hoping you guys enjoy seeing Gundam games. Because it's Gundam. Hey! No sniping! Ow. Jerk! I'll shit you for that. I'll shit your face. Oh, wait, I just realized something. I don't want to think about it. Oh no. Oops, sorry, wrong thing. See that picture of the Earth in the top right corner? I think we're about to go into a multi-stage war. I hate those. Ah, shit. Okay, here we go.
There we go. What's up? Clearly needs a little control to activate it. Oh, so he's the white wolf. Next thought again. Right. Oh, just this group down here still. Anyway, um, large beam sight. That sounds like fun. Too. Like, I know I can have it in Generation Genesis, but you're like, so overpowered I never use it. You are no hero! was complete and utter opposite of a hero. I wonder if you two actually have a thing together. No. Really? You and uh, Shard have something together? What a shame. That is disappointing as well. Or should I burning flare? I haven't seen that one yet. Okay, this out of that machine is really cool. But anyway, let's just bring up Lala. Right, I forgot. That's how it works in this game. That's just funnel just as we can. Okay, so that's why you speak the way you do for funnels. And the almost almost dead. That's good to know. Help! The help is no condition to keep the element alive. Okay, good. There isn't. That means you can die. God, that sounds so harsh. I mean, I know what I said. I don't. But still, if you're saying it, it's just like, wow. You 
actually really cool for this game, for this series of games, is they actually had a system where you could just like create your own, like kind of like um, Mario Maker, like create your own little text and everything else, and just post it for other players to play through your, your whatever campaign. I find it really cool. Of course, it'd be impactful as hell, but it'd be really cool. Eight are fine still. Uh, well. Ah, let's take it alone for now. Let's just keep it there. It's fine. Evade it, you're kind of dying. Oh! Let's see what the, Jaeg what the Jaeger can do. Sima? Well, now I know what the idea that H2 machine came from. The whole one that dances will shoot. In uh, the, one, the DLC that I kept fighting against online in uh, Gundam Versus. Yeah, when that thing came out, it was really popular. Not popular to swallow, though. This thing was a bane for me for a few for a little while. But I get over it. I just wanted to watch the melee because guns are guns for the most part. I, the guns are where you can actually fire back now! Yay! Wait. Between the machines. You're almost out of level, and you're almost out of level. It's just you guys. Why, but the generation degeneration series doesn't use uh Sima's marine for some reason. And it really bothers me. I don't know why they won't use her custom marine. Hey! She gave her a Like, I love that design better than the weird design they gave it in this series. That you see everywhere else. Oh, is he looking to attack it? Okay, well, obviously you, because you're going to be attacked. We already got a level, so we'll give it to him. And you do need a lot. You do need some experience. Gato. Good job, guys! We destroyed it! Ooh. 
Oh, I want to see the guy who's trying to answer them. Show me. Is this a suicidal? Oh, it's, yeah, it is this one. From the series. Oh, oh boy. Seema, dodge! Aww. Poor Sima. She's going to dodge. Oh well. I have the fence from now on. God damn you, suicidal chargers. Just die. No, you will be dead. Looks like they're coming to the field now. You're out of energy. Hmm. Okay, so you can make it in there anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Get back in the ship. Who wants a free kill? You do. Uh, you. Oh, that's funny. Crystal Vulcan! Think this is our killo. That's our objective. We don't need any help getting rid of him. Oh. So you have to use bits at close range, huh? Okay. I want to see this cross attack. That damage is it. That damage is you're dead. Live with it. Or don't. Because you're dead. 
Sorry, that's pretty impossible. <gasps> Excuse me, that is not a thing that you should be able to do. Got him. Ah, uh, I don't want to use the ability. Whatever. Show me the beam, Naginata. I'm interested. Morata. Don't die, Char. I kinda need to live right now, so I gotta come down and save you. I love it. Out of energy. Low on energy. Low on energy and health. I'll dollar, I'll dollar to your large powerful cannon. Nope. None of Haman. Wait, what? Thank <laughs> you. 